Welcome to the Tennis Warehouse shoe review of the Mizuno Wave Exceed Tour 6. Known for its explosively fast feel and superb comfort, this is not only the sixth generation of the Wave Exceed Tour, but also marks 10 years since it entered the tennis footwear market. New to this update is the Inner Z NXT foam, providing more cushion and responsiveness while keeping these shoes light and quick. By cutting down weight with the foam cushioning, Mizuno was able to increase the size of the D-Flex Groove support shank for improved stability and lateral support. A 3D solid unique upper design feels soft and flexible on top of your feet while still providing durability for dragging and easy ventilation. The new Dew Rubber Outsole Compound allows for great traction and lateral sliding while still being backed by a six month outsole durability guarantee. There's a lot to like about this update to the Wave Exceed Tour. Um, I really liked the traction. I felt super low to the ground in these shoes and was moving on the court really quickly. Durability too was better than expected for such a lightweight speed shoe. The outsoles have held up surprisingly well for me and also the uppers have resisted my toe dragging tendencies really well. The one knock I really had on the shoe um, was around the ankle collar and tongue. The tongue is just too thin and it doesn't go back far enough. So when I have the laces all the way to the last eyelet, the lace is actually resting on my foot um, and not on the tongue of the shoe. And so I had some pinching there and ended up going without the last um, eyelet laced up, using the second to the last one, not getting the ankle lock in I wanted, but getting way more comfort out of it. So uh, that was my one knock, but otherwise I thought it was a really nice blend of grip and give. So could slide out of shots quite easily, get all the grip I needed to then sprint to the next shot. So everything else worked for me. I'm um, loving the underfoot cushioning. Uh, again, good court feel, good blend of cushioning there. So uh, fun play test. This update felt very similar to the previous version, but with some nice subtle improvements. Uh, first thing I noticed was just how lightweight these shoes felt, um, like the previous versions. And also I really liked the underfoot cushioning. It felt nice and plush. Now I know on our website, we mentioned these as a medium width shoe, but because the toe box doesn't taper very sharply, uh, they were a nice fit for my e-width foot. Uh, now on court, I did feel that these shoes improved the stability. I felt like they were a bit more rigid when planting and pushing off. I also really liked the traction. It had a nice blend of grip and give like Chris mentioned. And I think if you are a hardcore slider, you're gonna be able to easily do so in these shoes. I think the one thing really holding this shoe back, like Chris mentioned, is that thin tongue. Um, I could just really feel pressure points on the top of my feet when I lace up my laces. And um, I think just adding a bit of cushioning to the tongue would really go a long way here. Overall, I think this shoe is improved from the previous version. It's a really nice lightweight offering and to boot, it comes with a six month durability guarantee. I was a huge fan of the prior model of this particular Mizuno shoe. The only knock I really had against it, it was just running a little long. It was a length based thing. They've definitely cured that. This is a true to size shoe with the Wave Exceed Tour 6. Uh, pun intended, it has definitely exceeded my expectations. Again, this is a lightweight shoe. You're gonna get tons of speed maneuverability out of it. And there's really not much of a compromise or sacrifice in terms of stability. I was really surprised. The shoe is a little minimal in terms of underfoot cushioning, but it does keep you very low to the court. And again, I am pretty impressed with how much cushion and, and uh, underfoot support that you do get out of this shoe. Breathability, not a problem at all. And I know there was a couple of uh, play testers that probably uh, appreciated a little bit more thickness to the tongue, uh, but I've kind of felt the round, thicker laces uh, compensated for that so I could really cinch down the laces and get a perfect fit out of it. One of my better play tests of the year in terms of a shoe, uh, and this one also features a six month sole warranty, and this just really brings it home. Coming into the play test for this Wave Exceed Tour 6, was really looking forward to it. I was a big fan of previous versions of this shoe. Um, I think my favorite before this was the fourth edition. Um, and for this one, really light, has that explosive feel. And one thing that I really like about the Exceed Tour line is typically with lightweight shoes, there's just not enough material underfoot. I always crave more of that plush feel, that cushioning underneath the forefoot, and this one definitely delivers that. It does a good job of staying low to the court for a fast, speedy shoe, um, but still feeling plush and comfortable. That new uh, Inner Z NXT um, midsole cushioning and the pounce material, really good job there. Uppers are just really soft, plush, um, a flexible feel, and I never ever get any sort of like toe jamming or crushing of the toes, so just superb comfort. Lightweight, like the feel of that, 
Um, like Chris and the other play testers have mentioned with the tongue, I wish Mizuno would go back to that tongue that they had with the fourth edition. It was much more plush, more extended up on the, uh, towards the ankle there. So I think that would be a good fix. Even if it adds a little bit of weight to the shoe so light and comfortable, it really would just make it a, a good, perfect all around lightweight shoe for me, but really liking it. Good traction and another really key feature here for being such a lightweight shoe, it comes back with that six month outsole guarantee for you tournament players, you team players. So I think this is just a great lightweight shoe and I'm gonna keep wearing this one a lot. And that wraps up our play test of the Mizuno Wave Exceed Tour 6. For more information on these shoes or anything tennis related, be sure to head to Tennis Warehouse, Tennis Warehouse Europe, or Tennis Only.